Yo, yo, what's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm RJ. Before I get into it, I just want to give a huge shout out and show love to everybody who's dealing with the hurricane. Of course, it's about to hit my home state of Florida. If you guys have not seen this. It is a very strong hurricane, Hurricane Dorian, that just ripped through the Bahamas. So much love to everybody in the Bahamas dealing with that. This is pretty scary, guys, so wish us luck here in Florida. So we're going to revisit the biggest mystery in Red Dead Redemption 2. And that is the missing princess. Despite the fact that I've given a few updates on this recently, and I thought I'd figured it out, I thought that she had been captured by the Aberdeen pig farm. We still don't have proof. People still reach out to me asking for some sort of news. But we do have a new challenger, guys. I think there might be somebody found not too far away from Van Horn that might have taken the princess. I'll show you some evidence. You guys have to help us out with this one because more than Gavin, more than any other mystery, People want to find this princess. We will finish off this video by showing the most likely location that you can find her, hopefully sometime in the near future. So here's the poster, guys. You can find it in Van Horn. No matter how many times you collect it, it will always be there when you come back. Now, it's a $100 reward. It may not seem like much, but if you know how the money works in this game, especially in online, $100 is actually a lot. We'll take that. Grand Duchy of Luxembourg. People have been talking about this girl since day one of Red Dead Redemption 2, and she is still at large. Now you can find a couple girls in Van Horn that look somewhat like her, but you know, if you look at the age, it really doesn't line up. And the most obvious clue is right here in Van Horn. At the fence, you can find some of her belongings. So does that mean that the owner of this fence, this dude right here, he does look shady. Do you think that he maybe took the Van Horn Princess and maybe put her objects out to sell? So look at this stuff, guys. You got the chest, you got some dolls, and there's a tricycle underneath it as well. That's the only clue we have to go on, guys. She apparently has toys. We'll check out another location that is a possibility where she was taken. Where is she? Where is Princess IKZ? Let's try to find her, guys. Here we are in the middle of the swamp. If you look to the left, there's a bunch of trees, but there's actually a cabin hello hidden behind there, them. Sir. You'll have a friendly guy hello. say hello as you approach it. The problem is he's not so friendly. I think that this might be the craziest character in the game, even crazier than the Aberdeen pig farmers. Hello, really sir. So I recommend that you do not take him up on his offer and go inside. Don't do it, but for the purpose of hello, this video, mister. we're gonna do it. So, you hungry, huh? I got sure, sure, okay. I got food inside. Now, as you can imagine, the princess must be on this side of the map, so she may have come across to this house below the end, right here in the middle of the swamp, and came across this guy, which would be horrible, but I'm going to show you inside his house. You can already see it. There's a lot of traces that he has done this before, kidnapped somebody who's come by. In this case, he knocks out Arthur. Oh, you struggled. So messed you up. Lost, but it was quite a tussle, I tell you. Quite a tussle, my pet. <laughs> my pet. You can use your imagination. See? But like I said, it Friendship seems like he's done this before. And neither is you. Still hear some struggling. So we're gonna wake up. Where are we? Middle of the swamp? Uh oh. Oh my lord. We are now approaching the cabin. Let's get revenge. So he says, not you again. Cowards and goes back inside. That's not going to help you, buddy. So he won't run. He'll just kind of hide here. But if you look on the wall, you can see some shackles. There's a chain right here. And then you have the same dog. Now, we've seen this doll in multiple places, but we know that the princess likes to play with them. So seeing one here maybe points to the fact that he had a young girl in this cabin at some point. Who could it possibly be? Well. You look at this. Oh, Lord, Tell us the no. truth, buddy. You can also see newspapers on the wall. There is an article about the missing princess in one of the newspapers. Unfortunately, we cannot read these, as it looks like there's some sort of moss or fungus all over them. They must have been up for a while. My guess is that not only could one be about the missing princess, but maybe some other stories that this guy was secretly involved in. Now, on top of the doll, there's also the tricycle. You see that up there? So he hid away the tricycle. It could have belonged to her. But there's one thing I really have to ask you guys about, and that is this. What is that? You don't think that that's 
chopped up princess, do you? Chances are it's some sort of pickled pig's feet or something, but I don't know. I really can't figure it out. Maybe it's the princess. Let me know what you guys think, but between the tricycle, the doll, it looks like he definitely had some kids here. Possibly a girl. He chained him up. Look at that, man. The chain right there on the bed. Extremely messed up. And whatever this is, guys, I'm sure one of you must know what it is. Now, there is no direct proof, guys, but considering this dude has done this many times before, and then you have the doll on top of the chest, maybe that does show that he is the one who could have taken the princess. Why would Rockstar add the biggest mystery, have something that everybody wants to know the answer to, but... You know, we don't really have that obvious answer at all. All right, so there's one of your candidates, guys. Could he have stolen the missing princess? Let me know what you think. That is definitely a possibility. But there's some other good chances as well. we got the Aberdeen Pig Farm. And I think that the biggest possibility is that she's going to be somewhere online. Here's one more close look at the chest. Clearly, Rockstar wants us to find this girl. It says IKZ right there on the side, making it very obvious. Some people have hit me up saying that this could be a casket. Maybe the princess is inside the chest. Well, that's probably not the case because we found the chest in one other location, and that is online, possibly telling us that that is where she's going to be. You may have stopped playing Red Dead Online, but you can find this, and Rockstar is about to add the summer update. It desperately needs an update, but it seems like it's going to be a good one. New missions, possibly new stuff to buy and find. But in this case, we have the IKZ... In one of our camps, the trippy posse managed to capture the picture. So that shows you that Rockstar also put that same IKZ mystery in online. And considering that's probably where the story is going to continue, I think they'll probably add something with that mystery in an online DLC. Once again, we'll cover the update for you guys. We got you covered on both consoles, Xbox One, PS4. You can join up. We actually just joined up on Xbox One for the first time over the weekend in a Red Dead Online live stream. It was a lot of fun. We'll be continuing this week and hopefully coming across the princess together. That would be epic. But there's the candidates, guys. You got the Aberdeen pig farm, possibly online, and the creepy dude in the swamp. Let me know what you think happened to Missing Princess IKZ. I still think there's a good chance that the psychos from the Aberdeen pig farm ate her. Now, we are back as John. We, of course, took them out as Arthur. So a lot of the furniture is missing. The creepy picture of the mom is still up. Now, if you look at the back of the cabinet, there's a bloody rag. Maybe that was used on the princess. There's also some old clothes that were left behind. But most of her toys are gone. There's still just one left. You can see it in the corner. And I think that really the only thing we can point directly towards the princess is some royal jewelry that you can find hidden underneath this floorboard. It's kind of hard to move it. Let's see if we can pull this off. You got to do the spin maneuver or the roll maneuver. There we go. Now you can see it. Along with all the toys, you know the princess had to have some jewelry, and I think that that is them. Tammy Aberdeen probably took them for herself, hid them underneath the floorboard, but because that Arthur took them out, they remain hidden here for anybody to collect. So let me know what you guys think. Much love. I got a few more episodes in the works, but with so many people hitting me up about the princess, that's, I think, the latest update, guys. I believe we won't get the answer until online. Maybe we'll find out that that creeper from the swamp did something during an upcoming mission. Adios muchachos, stay tuned and stay trippy my friends. Y'all come back now, you hear?